I am Andrew with Baker's Gas. Uh, we're here today with some very exciting news. Um, you're probably wondering what I have in my backpack. But it is, we partnered with a technology driven company and they brought to us a new line for our company. And I'm going to show it here today. But uh, let's open the backpack and see what I got. So, in this backpack, got my helmet. Pretty sweet but what's even sweeter is what's inside so it's it's unique because what's inside doesn't usually fit in the backpack um, so we're gonna open it kind of give you guys a little sneak peek as to what I have just see here so it fits in there it's small but we have here is all new Accu pocket, my Fronius, which is a battery powered welder, uh, Accu pocket 150. So, brand new to us, like I said, we're partnering with Fronius now. Exciting news, they're a technology driven company. Yes, they have a whole line of professional welding tools, um, but today we're going to dabble into this new Accu pocket 150, which is unique because it is battery powered. Um, and we're gonna try it out. So I'm gonna weld with it, and then you guys give us feedback. Let us know what you wanna hear different or what, do you, what you wanna see us do with it. Um, Cause it's so unique to the market. It's been out for a while, but it's new to us. Um, and I'm gonna give it a shot and put it through the test. We also brought in a uh, special guest from Fronius today, and uh, he's gonna be answering some questions that uh, a lot of people have been asking since this machine hit the market. All right, so we're here with our special guest, Chris Bliven from Fronius. Thanks for coming, Chris, bringing the new AccuPocket with you. How's it going, everybody? Oh, man, I'm excited to see this thing. So we have this new 24-pound AccuPocket 150, 24-pound. You saw it in my backpack, super light. So what it is, it is a DC stick welder with TIG capability, but what makes it unique, battery-powered. Uh, battery-powered unit, awesome thing. So in the package, you get your stinger, ground, battery charger, and the machine. So, a couple of good features that are going to come with it. How long does the battery last? On 8th inch, we're going to relate it to stick electrodes. So, 7018, if you run 8th inch, you can get 7 to 10 electrodes out of it before you deplete the battery. 332, 7018, you get 17 to 20 electrodes out of it. How long does it take to charge? Um, with this unit on a 20 amp circuit, 30 minutes to go from low battery to completely full. Pretty awesome. Yeah, this warranty, three year warranty. Uh, within that three years, you could replace that battery. Um, no charge under warranty. Uh, it is a, that's the full thing. Three year warranty on the unit. Uh, so Chris, is, before we weld with this thing, is there anything that I missed on application uh, for this unit? I, th I think you uh, got to look at the market and what you do and your daily task. Okay. So how mobile are you? And the other thing is, is you got to look at this machine as like a secondary tool to your operation. Because how long does it take you to back your truck up, refuel that engine drive, string your leads? If you're just doing seven to ten welds, you got to really think about your time versus value. Okay. So that's one big benefit to it. So Sweet. I say we get going. Yeah, absolutely. Let's do it. All right, so now we got the uh, new AccuPocket set up. I'm just gonna toggle through it, just see it, show you how easy the setup on this unit is. Um, so I chose stick at right, 100 amps. I'm gonna toggle through, just checking out um, the hot start. We're at 150%, so we're 50 amps over the 100 amp. And then there's my dig, we're at 55. So simple as that. I'm gonna run eighth inch um, electrode, so we're gonna go up to 125. I got a nondescript 7018, eighth inch. See how it starts. Wow. Well, you saw all the easy. It started right up. That's pretty cool. Um, all right, let's jump over. I got some 332nd. 718, 
we'll bump it down. What do you say, Chris? 100 amps? Yeah, I say, yeah, let's do 100 amps. Could be 190, it depends. 100 is good. Okay. Um, so, as you can see, it's chipped right off of it. So that 332, eighth inch, and it ran a bolt, nice, very nice arc on that. I like that a lot. Let's, let's bump it down. I got some 6011 and some 6010. Let's just try, so on this setting, we're gonna go down to the cellulose setting. We got 100 amps, we're gonna just see what the, 30%, 50 on the dig. Okay, cool. Let's see. 332? 332, what do you think? No, it's, uh, it's eighth inch. Mm -hmm. Yeah, somewhere around 95. Yeah. Give it a shot. So now this is a 6010 red rod. So this is generally other competitive equipment will not run this. It won't hold the arc. Let's see if this thing can do it. Now, you might have noticed a little audible difference in that when I was doing there. I was trying to stub that electrode out. It would not. It was digging. It did. It would not stub out. Amazing. I mean, other competitive equipment. It won't, it won't do that, it wouldn't handle it. It'd stop right in the middle. And I think we've seen that in past videos. Let's try some 6011 here. So it even ran that even really well too. That's, that's that's an amazing unit, Chris. I'm, that's impressive. Mm -hmm. Yeah, with the cellulose rods, like 6010, 6011, you can literally drive that rod right through this plate if you wanted to. Wow. I mean, it would not stop. I was trying to bury that electrode in it. It, it just kept digging. So, amazing. Um, so, Chris, one of my questions that keeps looming in my head is, with all the other people that build machines, why, why Fronius? Mm -hmm. It's the million-dollar question. You know, like, he, at shows and stuff, they thought people ask you that question all the time and uh, one thing about Fronius you know we're in our third generation of family we're a family owned company and not only that we're a technology driven company so what I mean by a technology driven company is we literally take 30 percent of our yearly revenue and put it in research and development okay um, in regards to staff in R&D we have over 700 employees in R&D so when you think of a battery powered stick tig welder that's how we can come out with new innovations like that new softwares, new waveforms, and that's where Fronius really stands out. Okay, so you're kind of setting yourself apart because you are mm -hmm. cutting edge. Yeah, we, uh, we try to be the trendsetters. Okay. So instead of copying products, uh, we want to come out with something that uh, you may not think is a problem, but we'll come up with a solution anyways. And that's what Fronius does. All right, awesome. Well, you heard it right there, folks. There's the million dollar question. So, Chris, I want to thank you again for being here. Uh, thanks for watching the video, guys. Stay tuned for more. Tune in at Baker's Gas on YouTube. Um, and remember, this machine is now available at bakersgas.com. And we're going to throw out a promo code. It is Perfect Welding. And with that promo code, you can get that GB100 that I had on in the very beginning for 50 bucks. So, just to get cue, cue you in on some more things. We're partnering with Fronius because they are a family-owned company. We're a family-owned company, and they are technology-driven. We like to support technology-driven companies with new R&D, new welding equipment, new things. We want to be on the cutting edge also. And uh, like I said, stay tuned for more videos. Thanks.